Yes guys, how are we doing? Darren Bent here for the YouTube channel. It's Darren here by the way, Darren Bent, here to bring you another video. As always, I'm going to get you guys to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, uh, and that notification button. So when I drop one of these videos, you guys will hear about it first. Uh, and as always, you know, I mean, if you don't find me on, on the YouTube, hit me up on the uh, Instagram, at Darren Bent, Twitter, at Darren Bent, or TikTok, at Darren Bent TV. Uh, now today's video, again, is about the shoe, which is my number one shoe. Not this particular model, but the, top, the particular brand, first of all, the brand of shoe and the, the type of shoe it is, and that, of course, is an Air Max One. Um, I've spoke to you before um, about how much I love Air Maxes. Jordan One I'm, are my favourite Jordans, but when it comes to the whole sneaker shoe, Air Max One is, is the number one for me. I absolutely love it. From the Pat of Cherry Woods and to obviously the Atmos pack is my favourite. I've always I've always said that before, the Atmos which came out and I think it, I think it came out in 2007. That's always my favourite. That's my number one shoe of all time. I don't think you can go wrong with an Air Max One. Shout out James Ells for that because he was the one who got me onto that. Because probably back in the early 2000s, I wasn't really feeling Air Max if I'm honest. And he was the one who told me to persist with it. And now I'm an Air Max one not. So I've got him to thank for that. This one here is about the uh, the soft grey crepe. We've seen a crepe come out already. The hemp crepe came out the last year. Came out last year, the, the crepe hemp. Um, and I think the soft greys I'm about to show you, I think they run them close. Whenever you get that kind of gummy sole, you can't go wrong with that. It, it almost looks like a corkscrew type gum sole. You can't go wrong with that. Um, so yeah, without further ado, let's show you the shoe. Let's get the shoe here. We've got the box here, the official Air Max box. Let's read the official tag. Nike Air Max 1 PRM. Soft grey, neutral grey, and then obviously it always comes in a different uh, language we're going to try and pronounce for you. Uh, gris Dois. Uh, gris Noir. Uh, to probably not to, to do with that. But hey, let's get them out, eh? Ooh! Bad boy shoe. Put them on there. Put them on there. Put the box down here. Soft grey. Crepe. That is what you call a bad boy shoe. Honestly, when it comes to Air Maxes, I absolutely love them. And look at, again, the detail. We're talking about the gummy sole. There you go, gum sole. Can never go wrong with a gummy sole. You've got the um, the uppers, that suede soft type material, of course. You know, it's, you know it's the, the air bubble. The midsole, the white, the, the hard plasticky, um, not even plasticky, like kind of some nice rubbery uh, midsole. The gray laces, uh, the swoosh, the leather, the leather, hard leather on the swoosh. Um, almost like a, the suede on the side of the shoe, this, this soft gray is absolutely lovely. And we know next month, the 26th of March, is National Air Max Day. So we're gonna be pulling out some of our absolute favorites, some of our absolute bangers. So I think when the time comes, I'll put out some of my favorites I've got in my collection and show you guys because Air Max Day is a, it's a very special day for me. I absolutely love it. I'm sure if you're a big Air Max One fan, um, you'll love it as well. I always think to myself when I think of Air Max Ones, I don't. I think it's de definitely a, a European, uh, more base shoe. I know the American culture they do tend to wear it, but I think they're more Jordan, Jordan, Jordan. Here, European. Um, I think it's more Air Maxes. Certainly when I've been to say uh, the Netherlands, um, they're massive on it, the Dutch. They're absolutely huge on Air Maxes. Shout out the boys. I think the shop's called Prime. I think it's Prime that I used to buy a lot of my Air Maxes from. So shout out them boys in Utrecht. But again, coming with the absolute fire with this shoe here as well. We saw the concept packs last year. They were in my top 10 in shoes that the release of last last year. Not last last year, last year 2022. Um, and these, these are absolutely lovely. Again, look at the colorway, the just soft gray. This is a shoe that you can wear with absolutely anything. The Nike Air on the back as always, the Nike Air on the tongue as well. Again, you can't go wrong with an Air Max shoe. I think in the next month, I think we're gonna be seeing a, a new release, the red Air Maxes with an even bigger air bubble. Now we get the, we're looking at the bigger air bubble, which I'm really looking forward to seeing it. I've only seen pictures of it, but certainly when they get a release, I'm definitely gonna be trying to get them. But back to this shoe, soft gray i know some people are a little bit hit or miss when it comes to air maxes i'm certainly not i love it it is my favorite shoe it's the most comfortable shoe i think it looks great with anything and yeah i'm really looking forward to when air max day is with us when you start looking at the you look at these compared to the crepe hemp and do you know what i'm going to get the crepe hemp out for you when you look at the crepe hemp i mean oh, when you start when you when i've got this in my hand now and i'm looking at the soft gray 
I'm starting to think, you know what, mm, this, I think this is the one, the Crep Hemp one is, oh, Air Max one, look at the colour on that, but the, obviously again the gummy sole, let's have a look at here, the gum sole, Boop. that is a, an unbelievably nice looking shoe, the colourways in the brown, I know I've done a video on these before, um, beautiful, beautiful, the really, really nice tan suede there, oh, lovely shoe there, but listen, it's not about you now. Stop being jealous. Stop being selfish. You know, I've done you already. It's about this shoe here. Um, yeah, the soft grey. I really recommend this to people. I think a lot of people will like this shoe. Um, but I'm a big Air Max One nut. So I'm pretty sure when it comes to a 2023 list, again, when we hit the end of the year, there will be a couple of Air Maxes in there for sure because... I'm an Air Max One guy, and that's what I, I like to do. So that's what I'm going to do. So listen, as always, let me know what you guys think of this shoe. Do you like it? Are you going to try and cop? I got these from End, as always. Shout out to them boys at End. They always look after me. I think these are still sitting. I think you can still pick them up for a good price as well. I think around maybe 170 I think you can maybe get these for. Maybe slightly above. Um, but listen, let me know what you guys think in the, in the comments underneath. Do you like Air Max One? Are you feeling the Air Max One? If not, what shoes are you looking forward to? Um, what shoes are you looking forward to trying to get? And are you looking forward to Air Max Day, the 26th of March? I want to be seeing some of the, the heat out there that you guys have got. As I said, we're trying to grow together, trying to grow as a family. Um, so let me know what you guys think. As always, make sure you stay safe. Enjoy your day. Peace.